Most accurate forecast in the Ozarks. Well, this is the kind of weather we've been enjoying today where you don't really even want to go back inside. It's so nice outside. Uh, right now, starry skies, 64, light winds out of the northeast. Temperatures today did hit 80 in Springfield. Just hit 80, though. Didn't go over. Uh, areas off to the east and south, though, managed to stay below the 80-degree mark. Uh, you can see our warmest readings over toward Joplin, 84 this afternoon there. Let's take a look at the month of September. And what we find is that, for the most part, it's been a mild month so far. Uh, we have not hit 90 degrees this month. In fact, we have not hit 90 degrees in about two and a half weeks. And I don't see us hitting 90 degrees through uh, probably the rest of this week. But we could start seeing some 90s once we get into this upcoming weekend as our pattern will be shifting gear, shifting modes back into a hotter mode uh, later this week and through this upcoming weekend. Right now, though, we're still feeling the uh, benefits of this storm to our northeast up near the Great Lakes. Uh, that mild fall air that built into the area yesterday still in place over the area, and that's going to allow for another cool night tonight under clear skies. Temperatures will drop into the 50s and another gorgeous day tomorrow. Uh, sun filled day, a day where you're really, really going to have to like, you know, really kind of look to try to find a cloud in the sky. For the most part, it looks like crystal clear blue skies. Temperatures tonight, they're going to settle out in the mid 50s, so not as chilly as last night. About 54 for a low in Springfield with highs tomorrow, generally in the mid 80s across the area as those temperatures will be marching higher day by day. It looks like 85 in Springfield. That shot of fall air, again, we're still enjoying it right now, but it is on the way out as that storm pulls off to the east. And what will replace it but a late summer feel? And it looks like as we uh, cruise into this upcoming weekend and into early next week, that late summer feel is really going to take hold across the areas. We find a trough developing here in the western U.S. and that helps to force warm air into the middle of the country. What were we going to find out of that pattern? The nights are going to be comfortable. The afternoons are going to be a little bit on the hot side, especially this weekend into early next week when it looks like highs up around 90 degrees will be a possibility. And uh, with this pattern, no sign of rain. Uh, looking at the next 10 days, uh, you can see the temperatures are going to be uh, generally above normal, at least in regard to those afternoon highs, staying above normal all the way through this weekend into Monday and Tuesday. And you can see Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, that's where we're looking at highs up around 90 degrees. After that, though, uh, looks like that little mini heat wave will give up pretty quickly, and we're going to see temperatures falling back to something closer to normal around Wednesday to Thursday of next week. Why? Because we're going to have a cold front moving through our area then. And it looks like that will probably be our next chance at uh, at least the opportunity at more in the way of widespread rainfall in our area. You might be wondering with highs up around 90 this weekend, is that unusual? Well, not really. I uh, did some looking and you can see we can get 90 degree days all the way into the month of October. In fact, our latest 90 degree day in Springfield was the 11th. And as you head further south into northern Arkansas, it can go well into the month of October. In fact, our latest 90 degree day in Harrison, Arkansas, October the 28th. Your 70 forecast shaping up to be a quiet one across the area. Sunshine, 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 lots of sunshine. We'll see a few clouds, I think, on Friday, also on Saturday. Uh, temperatures, you can see how the lows and the highs are going to be climbing. 85 tomorrow, 87 Wednesday, about 86 on Thursday, 87 on Friday. So we kind of plateau here. And then we're up uh, in the upper 80s on Saturday and up near 90 for a high on Sunday with highs around 90 on Monday of next week. The overnights also will, will be climbing, overnight lows, I should say. Looks like we rise out of the 50s into the 60s starting Thursday. And I think over the weekend into early next week, uh, it's going to take on more of a summer feel in the low department as well with lows in the upper 60s. Uh, but it'll be a short-lived little heat wave in September. Humidity has been down, which has made even the more elevated temperatures feel pretty comfortable. Yeah, this is going to be a dry heat that we find through the weekend. Awesome. Mm -hmm. All, right. All right. Thank you, Jamie. Now